Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the vlog. If you're new to the channel, a big warm welcome. My name is Tristan Mortlock. This is Captain's Vlog. We've got a vessel just pulled up next to us. He's just dropping his anchor over there. It is a beautiful day, flat, calm, really hot day today. There's not a breath of wind, so really struggling to keep hydrated today. Um, so a little bit different today. We cruise past the famous sailing yacht A, and I'm intrigued to know what you guys think of the boat. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to show you some footage I took earlier. We did a tour around sailing yacht A. I haven't made my mind up yet what I think about it, but I'll be really interested to hear what you guys think. Um, so do post a comment of your thoughts in the comments box below, because I'll be really interested. Um, today, we left Nice this morning. We came over to, we did a tour around sailing yacht A. Then we're now anchored here. Uh, on the north side of the Can Islands, just off the prison where the man in the iron mask started, or the story of the man in the, man in the iron mask began. And as you can see, it is something of a spectacular day. This is the ultimate paradise for super yachts or yachts in general. You can see all around people in jet skis. Boats, paddle balls, sea bobs, jet surfs. Fantastic day. I know a lot of you have said we can never put these umbrellas up, but they, today we definitely needed them. So let me know, guys, what you guys think. So I'd be really interested to hear what you guys think of selling your A. Here we've got the fortress where the story of the Iron Man um, started back in the 1700s. So this is the Northern Island, St. Marguerite. So I took a little flyover to give you guys a bit of a perspective of um, the islands. There's two islands, you've got the St. Marguerite and they're both called the Ile de Leron. And you can see there, just in the distance, that's a southern island. So there's a bit of water between the, between the two. And I'm just gonna turn around now, a bit of uh, some Drone footage of AWOL and chasing AWOL at anchor here. I think we're anchored about 20 meters of water here. And uh, shortly the guys are going to be jumping on the chase boat. There's Jason with a cleaning bucket. He's going to wash some uh, windows and the master cabin um, with, uh, with the chase boat. David, the chase boat captain, is going to be driving the chase boat round. And I think the first thing I start off round, uh, the head round to the port side. And then uh, Jason will be standing on the, on the bow and uh, to give it a clean. First of all, as you can see, he's putting the fenders up on starboard side just in case, uh, just in case uh, a bit of waves knock the boat towards the towards AWOL. He says waves there from a wake from another boat that was absolutely speeding in a non-speeding zone. So people, please learn the rules of local areas you're navigating in. So here they go on their way. David with his very cool hat on, his very cool hat on. And you can see that it's coming up here alongside, on port side. Get a bit of a wipe. I think kind of, he's kind of hoping he's going to fall in because it's a boiling hot day today. So uh, he's probably praying that he falls in. Um, but there you go, give it a good clean. That's a master cabin there where he's wiping. So it's a nice view out of the master cabin. And it's completely tinted. So you can see out, but you can't really see in. You can see on the bow there, Barbara's there doing some rinsing because every time we anchor, we get all the, the little dust and a bit of dirt coming out of the anchor locker. So she has to rinse it every time we drop anchor and lift anchor. 
and then Jason almost just falling in there. Um, so yeah, these guys are doing a bit of a clean, just keep themselves busy uh, while the guests are just chilling. I think they're on the bridge deck or on the on the sun deck. And then you can see David is monitoring. He's using the engines and the bow thrusters to keep the nose towards the uh, that window there. And once they've cleaned here, they come around the starboard side and clean the starboard side as well. At the entrance there below the AWOL sign, you saw Michaela. Here's a different angle of the fortress again. And just below here is the restaurant La Garite. So if you're ever in Cannes and you come to the Cannes Islands, I highly recommend this restaurant. Some great music, great atmosphere, fantastic food. Not the cheapest place to go, but it's it's delicious and definitely worthwhile. Definitely worth but worth a visit, if not just to see all the beautiful yachts that are normally anchored in the bay. So I'm going to leave you this in a bit of a view, guys, so you can enjoy this and uh, I'll play some music for you. So it's the end of the day now, it's coming up uh, quarter past six. Uh, the deck team are busy putting all the water toys away, the sea bobs, the jet surfs, the stand up paddle boards. And so what I'm going to do while I'm doing that, I'm going to give them a hand to speed things up. I'm going to put the umbrellas down, start packing up the bow, and then we're going to lift anchor and head into port.
could you, Barbara, Barbara, could you call the port and ask them where they want us to go? Is it the first one or the second one? The second one. Yeah. It's terrible. And that, guys, is how you dock a super yacht without using a bow thruster. Right, as always, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you did like that video, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't done already, please do subscribe. Um, again, for those of you who don't know, if the channel gets 100,000 subscribers by the 14th of September 2019, the Super Yacht Captain YouTube channel will be donating 10,000 euros to charity. And all you have to do is click that subscribe button. So I really hope I can count on your subscription. Thank you so much. I look forward to seeing you guys next video.